Hey guys! Welcome back to Joran Maria and it's Maria. Today is August 14 guys. 7 something in the morning. So in this video guys, I'm about to cook a smothered potatoes with smoked sausage. So if you can hear this smothered potatoes with smoked sausage or some sausage, depends on you how you cook it so if you can hear about smothered potatoes it's well known in Louisiana so I take some of the recipe of the smothered potatoes from the granny of Jeron so without further ado we start our cooking <music> So guys, this is the ingredients of our smattered potatoes with smoked sausage. I have here 1 fourth cup of butter, 1 teaspoon of vegeta. This is the vegeta guys. I always use it every time I cook. Make some more, test your test. And I have here a black pepper, a salt, onion powder, garlic powder. And the smoked sausage, I just use the half. And then, as you can see, I slice this in small or a uh, dice slice. And then I have here onions, same thing. I slice it, uh, dice slice. And of course, we have our potatoes. Slice a dice slice or cubes and instead of we're using water I want to use a chicken broth so it depends on you what you like to put your recipe so some of this I just put some of these ingredients is I just add something so I want my dish more tasty than a shiswa so well, the family will be happy. So we'll start cooking, guys. So we have our pot here. I already switched on our gas, as you can see. I have a pot here. So we will wait that our pot will become warm already before we put our salted butter. When I cook guys, I always prefer from the side, the spatula of course, the plates, and some spoons if ever you need. I, always, and I don't want to put my spatula everywhere when I cook, so I always put in in a plate. So our pot is already hot, we put our butter, so now our butter is melted, put your gas on low. We, we just use a slow cook so our this will not be burned so the next of the butter I put my onions Make sure guys that your onions is already cooked before you put your next ingredient. So the next of the onions, I'm about to put the smoked sausage. So we will wait the onions will cook already before we put the smoked sausage. So now the onion guys is looks ready already so the next is our smoked sausage the 
the same procedure guys we need to make our smoked sausage a little bit brown before we put our potatoes so guys this smoked sausage is ready so now we're about to add our potatoes This is an easy recipe guys, very easy. If you want to try it in your home, let the family taste it. Try it guys, it's very tasty and healthy. Make your potatoes a little bit browny. Little bit brown, so you need to fry it more. And then, if you it will be brown already, you can add your chicken broth. So we will cover first guys, and then we will check it back. Don't forget guys, always check it. So before you put your chicken roll, you need to make your potatoes a little bit brown. So guys, let's put our black pepper and salt. We put some salt. It's up to you how much you put it. Make sure that your smothered potatoes is not salty. It's a black pepper. The onion powder. The garlic powder and the rest the beef chicken. I don't put all my beef chicken guys. I will add later. We will taste first if tastes fine already. So we need to add more because our chicken broth is already have salt. I don't put a lot of salt when I'm cooking so we will taste it if it still needs salt we add our vegetable so we cover it again and then we check it so if we will see that our potatoes already brown we can add our chicken broth So guys, I am not na natin. So guys, so guys, it's ready already. As you can see, have already let brown brown. So now we can add our chicken broth. Chicken broth, you need, you no need to put a lot. You just put little bit that make your potatoes smooth or tender. So you can add more if really need it. So let's try. Let's test it. This 
this time we need to add the pichita because a little bit uh, need more little bit salt so instead of I'm using salt I will put the rest of the pichita we'll cover again and shake it back make sure to shake it back potatoes guys we need to smash it but not all so we will make sure that it's a little bit some of this is smashed some is this is no so that's look yummy already guys as you can see it's almost done So guys, our smothered potato is all done. So as you can see, that's easy to make. This is good if you alternate your mashed potato into smothered potatoes. Yeah, I'm sure that they will like it. They will like it guys. Let, let try. Try it to your home and let your family test about this mothered potato so our mother's potato is all done thank you guys for watching and see you in our next vlog god bless you all and we love you stay safe and stay healthy bye guys